Hey, Scott here, Scotty's Animals. Uh, I'm just in the middle of cleaning Nate's cage here, and I noticed he has a big clump of grease from his grease gland, and I'm peeling it off, and it's a big clump right here. Can you see that? Uh, focus on the grease clump. There we go. You see that? Okay. If you notice, it's greasy. It's like oil. It looks like it's really disgusting, especially since it's got <laughs> Nate's stinky butt hair in it. <laughs> but here's the thing. It's actually not gross. It actually doesn't smell funky or gross. In fact, it doesn't smell like anything. The closest thing that it actually smells like is like some grease that you'd put on your bicycle or skateboard bearings. Um, so I just wanted to talk a little bit about guinea pig grease glands. Uh, boys and girls have them, but mostly it's prominent with boys as far as it getting really greasy. Now if Nate will be cooperative, right at the base of his spine, you will see a grease gland and uh, I'm not sure what it does but okay now if I work right here there is a little bit more grease and you want to be very gentle with this because a lot of time it gets stuck on the hair but whoa here we go that's an even bigger piece and again just to prove that uh, uh, like it's like you know what it's like you know it's almost exactly like Sculpey so what, what you use to, to do those um, little craft projects, it has absolutely no funky odor. If you want funky odors, the guinea pig bore pocket here uh, is quite funky. But this, and that's a subject of a whole new video, the Los Angeles guinea pig rescue health checks that, that you might find on their channel might be some of the best videos about the bore cleaning and bore pockets because Saskia is an expert at that all the volunteers are but I just wanted to <laughs> talk about um, grease glands here I'll show a shot of his grease gland up close and I'll try to show some other piggies grease glands so that you can see what I'm talking about it's being very good the grease gland would be right here Here's his spine, and there's the end. Okay, there's his package. <laughs> but right here, you can see it's just like a little greasy clump. You just want to make sure that um, it's not dirty. Oh, here's the last little bit. See this? You see that? Aside from the funky hair, aside from the funky hair, it has no gross smell. What are we going to do with all this grease? <laughs> You're not amused. Nate and I just wanted to dispel the myth that grease glands are funky. They're not funky. They are greasy. But they're not funky. I promised I'd show what a grease gland looks like on a white piggy. So here's Cash. He's kissing me. Either that or he tastes something funky on my arm. Cash, I want to show them your grease spot. Now he smells. <laughs> Cash, I want to show them your grease spot too. Come on. Come on. <laughs> this piggy is so fun. He is my foster. His name is Cash. Amber and TJ saved him. Come on. <laughs> He's so rambunctious. This is how we're going to have to do it. Come here. <laughs> you crazy man. Okay. So here you can see, because he's got white fur, it's a little greasier. I mean, it's not that it's greasier, it's just you can see it. There's, it's like a little grease gland. Oh, look at him, I love this guy. I honestly think he appreciates all the time that I've spent caring for him. Are we in love now? Oh, <laughs> look at your cheeks. <laughs> Give me kisses. Give me some more. So I just wanted to show you the difference between Cash's grease gland and Nate's because 
Uh, he's white, so you see a little bit differently, but it's nothing to worry about, really. Come here. <laughs> Unless, of course, uh, it gets infected. Sometimes it could get infected. It is a gland, so you'd want to just check it, you know. But if it's, if it's a little bit greasy, it's nothing to worry about. You can clean it with a little oil of your choice, olive oil or coconut oil, and you can... Where are you going? Oh, do baba. You can work it out, but it's not really something that you should be concerned with unless it gets infected. But Let me know your experiences with guinea pig grease glands. Have you had any problems? Do you think they're funky? <laughs> they write it in the comments. All right, thanks for watching, guys.